was a good money-making opportunity in the national TV game Saturday night on ESPN between Western Kentucky and Alabama. It might be a mismatch on paper. It's not a question who's going to win, but who covers is a question with the point spread, of course. And I've got some good angles for you and some good analysis and a reason why you should play this game and make some money coming up free for you in this video in just a moment. Hi, this is Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, right back here on Wager Talk TV. And we're breaking down Western Kentucky at Alabama, 7 Eastern on ESPN. And of course, it's the debut of Kalen DeBoer. He came over from Washington after taking the Huskies to the national championship last year in just his second uh, season national championship game. Didn't quite get it done. And of course, the big story is no more Nick Saban. So yes, we can look at the past history of Alabama as a big favorite, and we will do so. But we also have to look at DeBoer's history the last few years at Fresno and Washington. And I think they both point to a reason to take Alabama, and I'm going to give you the analysis here in a moment. But first, let's talk with my start with my database simulation. 10,000 games simulated through my database every week for every game on the board. And this game projects to be about a 38-point Alabama win on average. So the line might look big at minus 32, but it's not big enough. It's about a touchdown short. I project a 38-point win for Alabama. So now we dig deeper. Is there motivation for the Crimson Tide to lay it on a weak lean like Western Kentucky? And I think there are several reasons why there is. First of all, it's DeBoer's debut at home. New fan base. He wants to make a statement. Alabama's backups are probably still more talented than the Western Kentucky starters. So even in the second half, it's going to be hard for them to take their foot off the gas. And Western Kentucky's weakness last year, and probably again this year defensively, is a poor run defense. They gave up almost five yards per rush last season against mediocre opponents. Alabama's going to smash the line of scrimmage, and their backups will still dominate the line of scrimmage even in the second half. Uh, let's look at the history of these two te these teams as big favorites, or Alabama and the coach DeBoer as big favorites, I should say. Uh, last year, Alabama wins by 49 over Middle Tennessee State as a 39-point favorite. The year before that, they went 55 nothing as a 42-point favorite. So, yes, they do have a history of blowing out weaklings at home in Week 1. Of course, that was Nick Saban, different staff for the most part. So let's dig a little bit deeper and look at Kalen DeBoer's track record as a head coach the last two years at Washington. He came in and beat Kent State by 25 as a 23-point favorite two years ago. And then last year, he routed Boise State by 37 points as only a 14-point home favorite. And we'll go back a little further. He had two years at Fresno, 2020 COVID season, only played like six or seven games. But 21 was his first full season at Fresno, and he beat UConn 45-0 in his home debut game one as only a 28-point favorite. So Alabama's had a track record of blowing teams out in week one at home. The fan base expects it. And DeBoer, DeBoer has had a history of doing it here in recent years at Washington and Fresno. So I think that's a double play here. And that's another reason to like Alabama. Plus the line value. I project a 38-point win. So if you're going to play it, you lay it with the Crimson Tide minus the 32 at 7 Eastern on national TV on ESPN Saturday night. Hey, if you're finding these free videos useful, be sure to click subscribe and hit the bell so you never miss out. I have a ton of different college football game videos this week. Also do daily baseball free play videos as well. So click subscribe and hit the bell for instant alerts when these videos go live on Wager Talk TV. My college football top 25 video analyzing the three biggest games of the week. Clemson, Georgia, Texas A&M, Notre Dame, USC LSU are, is on this channel as well. NFL Fade the Public video starts next week for week one of the NFL. Hey, speaking of baseball, as I head into Friday night on a 16 and 4, 80% baseball run the last few weeks. And I mention that because I know we're talking football, but baseball is still here for a couple more months. And boy, is it a great moneymaker. NFL starts next week. I've got several college football best bets this weekend for my personal clients at wagertalk.com. It's quite simple. If I have a play, my clients get it as well, and I'm very selective. About two to three best bets at most per day, so it's a fantastic opportunity to win with a longtime winner. I've done this now. It's my 29th football season as a professional handicapper, and we're going to win big this year like we have for every other year that I've been doing this for decades now. Baseball in a 16-4 and four run. College football is here starting this week, and my first best bets are set to go. Why not get my All Sports All Access? Buy two weeks, get the third week for free. It's a fantastic offer this weekend at wagertalk.com. Buy two weeks, get the third week for free. No promo code needed. It's on my page right now. Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. It works out to less than $10 a day. That's less than $5 a play for every baseball, college football, and pro football best bet for the next 21 days and nights. Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. And don't forget, I post a daily free play as well, a bonus free play. Games are just a bit outside for making the cut or on my page every day for free for everybody with analysis. Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Get there quicker with shortcut wt.buzz slash sm. You can follow me on X on Twitter at Steve Merrill, two R's, one L, on X at Steve Merrill, also on Instagram. 
Comment below here on the videos. I read all the comments. I'll reply back. What other games are you looking at this week in college football? Include some of your best bets and analysis. Let's win and learn and earn together here on Wager Talk TV. And on the way out, thumbs up, like is also greatly appreciated. And stay tuned here to Wager Talk TV for some more great free content coming up next.